Hello, this is Don at You Want Sun. To say that these are strange times we live in is an understatement. Our chief problem is the events that are occurring out in the world. We base our reality, perceptions, and decisions on what we see and hear, mainly through the internet, and to a lesser part, between ourselves. Unfortunately, much of that information is a mishmash of lies, distortions, and misdirects on real causation of events as they come along. Because of this, very often we find ourselves making decisions based on huge lies. For example, we are told the Seattle Chaz thing was an organic event, but research revealed that the overlord of Chaz was actually some millionaire raised by a white family called Chaz Simone who owned everything from payday loan stores bars, restaurants, and real estate companies. He was no hood guy as he was presented to us by the media. Also, the riots. They are sold to us as organic events, but they are none. They are, in fact, highly organized by high up members of the LGBT group and Democrats. Hundreds of buses, paid for hotel rooms, and a daily pay rate that averages between three and five hundred per day per person for organizers and thirty five an hour for the rank and file. Who was and is paying for all of that? And on it goes. All of the above you already know. Everybody knows. Another thing most of us know is how any death is being turned into a COVID death to manipulate us in the fall to taking their deadly vaccine and all the horrors that come with such a thing worldwide. It's important for us to remember we are involved in a spiritual warfare and on every level of our existence. Daily prayer, seeking out truth vectors wherever they may be found, <clears throat> is essential to understanding the factions and forces at work behind this very often arranged events they are pushing upon us to obtain their agenda. They don't want decency, normalcy, family, joy, and a relationship with the Most High, our Father. <clears throat> they stand against everything holy, good, and true. They are, and always have been, the real enemy of humanity. They are Nephilim, the long-standing seed line of Satan himself, and he has empowered them in every way to achieve world domination and the destruction of innocence. If you find you are doing something that lessens your innocence as a soul and in your character, they are behind your undoing at some point in your choice-making processes. Once we understand this, then we can begin to see that anything that encourages corruption is of the Dark One and his minions.